let's take a look at a few more aspects of categories in CMS, namely creating subcategories of subcategories and reorganizing categories on our website. So we do need a new category for our coffee. So first we're gonna add a new subcategory to our default category, just as we've done for mugs. So we'll click add subcategory, making sure that default category is selected. The category name is going to be coffee. For content, we'll say the best coffees sourced from around the world. Display setting, we'll go with products only, anchor yes. As before, I'm going to do price and product name. We'll take a look and see exactly what position means in just a minute. Here, we're going to order by default by product name. And we'll do $10 navigation price step. Search engine optimization for our URL key, we'll do coffee. For our meta title, we'll do coffee, capital case. Meta keywords, we'll just say coffee. Meta description, I'll use our page description. I'm not gonna add any products from the category page. We'll do that from the product pages this time. So we'll save that. Now, of course, we have a new subcategory but let's say that we want customers to be able to browse by coffee type and specifically coffee region because coffees from different regions have different flavor profiles. So we're going to add a subcategory to our coffee subcategory. So making sure that the coffee subcategory is selected, we're going to once again click add subcategory, category name. Let's go with African. And I'm not going to worry about creating a description for each individual subcategory of coffee. So we're just going to stick with African and we're not going to add any content here. Display settings, just as before, we'll do price and product name. By default, we'll use product name, a $10 price step, search engine optimization. We'll use African for our URL key or maybe even African hyphen coffee will be better. African coffee for our meta title, coffee, African coffee for our meta keywords. And for our meta description, we'll just say the world's finest African coffee. I'm not gonna add any products from here, so we're done with this. We're gonna add two more coffee subcategories very quickly. Make sure you don't click add subcategory from here because we need to go back up to coffee and add it as a subcategory of coffee. If we left it as African, then it would branch off yet again and create a subcategory of African coffee, which we don't wanna do. We wanna add another subcategory to coffee. So we're gonna add a subcategory. We'll go with Indonesian. Not gonna worry about any content. Display settings price and product name, default listing, product name, price step, $10, search engine optimization, Indonesian dash coffee for our URL key, Indonesian coffee in title form for our meta title, then coffee and Indonesian coffee for meta keywords and meta description, the world's finest Indonesian coffee. Save that. And one more going back up to coffee. We'll add a subcategory called blended. Display settings, price and product name, default listing, product name, navigation price step, $10, search engine optimization, blended dash coffee, meta title, blended coffee in title form, meta keywords, coffee and blended coffee, and meta description, blended coffee, 
made from some of the world's best coffee. And save that, and we're done with our subcategories. <laughs>